On September 24th, we started a 100 hour duration field trial of our new 250 kilowatt thermal reactor sun cell having a molten gallium to water heat transfer system to produce boiling water and steam on a continuous basis. In preparation for deploying sun cells to commercial customers to perform field trials in their facilities, we are testing commercial power levels under commercial operating conditions with start-stop, power control, cooling level, reaction condition, and other tests. A real-time excerpt of the trial that is still in progress and shown in this video, wherein we are testing dynamic control of power by controlling our breakthrough innovation of a means to condition the inflowing reactants such that they are in an equivalent chemical state as that of being at extremely high temperature. Other conditions such as plasma ignition power, hydrogen flow rate, and other parameters were maintained constant compared to the run posted on September 30th. Even though the reaction appears very energetic, the sun cell is very safe with the reactor pressure at less than 1% that of atmospheric pressure. No prior known chemical energy releasing reaction is possible. The power is proven to be from hydrino production at 200 times the energy of burning hydrogen by gas chromatography, electron paramagnetic resonance spectroscopy, X-ray photoelectron spectroscopy, Raman spectroscopy, and other analytical analyses. Our first market objective is the $8 trillion per year thermal market. More details on our new proprietary 100% pollution and CO2 free power source are given in our business overview presentation.